what's going on my beautiful people welcome back to swift reacts tv now what do we have today this one was requested randomly from a subscriber we got leon the professional now from as the title i'm guessing he's a professional i'm guessing every reactor probably says that whoever reacted to this movie as well but this movie looking classic looking little looking real classic looking and that guy the actor i'm guessing He's probably going to be Leon. I don't know. And then on top of that, I don't know. Something about this guy's face looks like it's going to. He looks like he specializes in action movies. So if it's an action movie, I'm down for that. Totally. It's my favorite genre. One of my favorite genres. Yeah. I don't know much to say about this because I I have no clue or any predictions of what's going to happen here. All I know is it looks like definitely an old movie. So let's let's check this out and see what's going on here it's gonna be it's probably gonna be a hidden gen um, that's what i'm hoping for that's what i'm hoping for all right all right let's get this started all right all right what? that's good Natalie Portman, I definitely heard of her before. Okay. Ah, uh, okay, so we're in Central Park, looking like New York City right here. Okay, okay. Yep, classic old New York City. For those who don't know, that's my hometown. Yeah. Oh, that was back when the World Trade Center was there. That's what's up. In like Chinatown, Little Italy, yeah. It's giving me, it's giving me like mafia vibes going on here. Allora, come and stay, Leone. Let's talk business. This fat bastard is trying to. Yeah, I'm free Tuesday. Oh, so you got to talk to Maurizio. You got to talk to this guy. Remember, neatness counts. You got one half hour. Okay, so we're dealing with big boy stuff here. Okay. Yeah, what? It's Tonto. There's a guy who wants to talk. Serious. Tell him I'm coming up. <laughs> serious. Oh, he's serious, all right. Okay. So he's like a hitman. Open your eyes. We got company. Look at them. You see them with all these classic looking guns. Huh. Some guns you would see probably like in the 90s and 80s. Oh, he's a genius. Smart. Okay. Oh, damn. How he got, up, got him to get up like that? Stay up. Damn. Okay. First out back and hurry up. This is getting crazy. Oh, he hung him by the arm. That's gruesome. Wow. Oh, no way. By the tie. That's crazy because I was wondering what if he didn't have a tie on? That move would have never worked, probably. Or maybe it would've, he would have probably grabbed him by the neck. Okay, so he's a little athletic. Damn, look at the old TV with the big butts. In the back. I remember those. It's cool. Take a nap. Oh, this guy's Batman. Oh, yo, he hung him. That is crazy. Block both the edges. Check the terrace. Shit, I'll be. He's he's all sweating and everything. He's after you. <laughs> yo, he is so shook. He's scared. Anybody would be, to be honest with you. It's like, that's crazy. He's singling you out, man. It's over. You're the only one left. Bro, you're wasting all your bullets. What are you doing? <laughs> He's like... Damn, look at that old phone. I'm like, how times have changed, huh? Somebody's trying to kill me. All right, let's stay on the line. 
sir. I'm going to connect you with an officer. Behind you. Behind you. Behind you, man. Behind you. I knew it. Ooh. No gun necessary. Took out the pocket knife. Hey, relax, man. Ain't been cut yet. Go ahead and take it. Cheers. He's about to offer him all his work. I own this number. Best to believe it, lady. Keep it, keep it going. It was fun and all. We had a good time, but you got to get out of here. Bye. She looking like Toad from Mario, if you know what I mean. Yeah. No, I mean, no. So it's safe to say today's your last day. And right. Let me speak to our mutual friend. Talk about knock off the competition. Skip town. You better skip town from, from after this. And let him go. You got 10 days. Nah. Do you understand? So say it. Uh, I understand. Wow. And that's, and he's gone in the shadows. Look at that. So, okay. So this guy really is a professional. Okay. He on, he liked that. He liked that. He's on that. <laughs> it's very stealthy. I like that. That was cool. He's tr it's very strategic too. Hola. <sighs> <sighs> Ah, the classic New York um, bodega look. Wow, that's crazy. I'm saying that, guys, because I feel like I rec I I think I recognize that area they're in, uh, that they're filming this movie at. It's it's, it's crazy. Let's see if I can find any information of when they filmed this. What what area? Of New York City, cause it's uh, it looked just so familiar. Mm. Nah, this didn't find nothing. Excuse me, little girl. What are you doing with that cigarette? Put that out. Hi. Why did you hide a cigarette? I don't want my old man to find out. You shouldn't even be worrying about the rats at this age. Oh. That explains why she's out in the hallway by herself with no supervision. I fell off my bike. <laughs> yeah, right. Hey, don't tell my dad about the cigarette, okay? I'm sorry. If it was me, I think I would have took that, that cigarette from that kid's hand. I would have been like, excuse me. This is not for you. Where's your parent? But I hold uh, stuff just like you give it to me. I don't look at it. I don't play with kids, man. When it comes to kids. 100% pure. Now it's July pure. Now somewhere between June and July. I'm just a holder. You give me the mm, stuff. I hold the stuff. That's all I know. This guy was cutting the work, look like. But, you know, if you're going to be a hard ass about it. <sighs> Sorry. He said, he, he said he didn't cut the dope. Oh. Oh, wow. I'm guessing this is the pro, the antagonist of the story. That cut was just too dramatic and he's looking all weird. The hell? <laughs> what the hell is this? He's sniffing the guy out, literally. Just do me a favor, noon. Hey, I didn't cut your shit. Mark. I did it already. Oh, yeah? Well, you can get it. Mm. And stop smoking cigarettes. She shouldn't be out here in the first place without supervision. Talking about bad parenting. Bad parenting, son. That's, I ain't gonna lie. Um, growing up in New York City, I seen a lot of that. Um, interesting parenting and kids running around. By themselves with no adult supervision. I seen that a lot. It's unfortunate. But New York City is like a place, and like any inner city that's huge, that's a big inner city in America. You kind of forced to grow up too fast. Nice plan. What's this? Meditating? You going to sleep? You go to sleep like that? Where's his where's his mattress? Oh, this guy. I don't know how his back is okay. My back would be messed up just like how it is right now. My back is crazy. 
Oh, oh, the channel, and I'll smash her face. The heck? Aww. She took my turn. She heard him, but I'm not the one that. Wow. Someone who's doing nothing all day but watching cartoons. You dare to say that again? It wouldn't be the first time. I mean, you always come. Well, this time. I think you can. Now, I'm gonna be late for work. Too far? Really feel it. Wow. Stomach in. And the kids are up too. It's like, come on, man. It's my oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh. oh my god. So, this is a very dysfunctional, very toxic family situation, I see. Fuck the household. Hello? This is Marguerite McAllister. Is Mr. or Mrs. Lando home? That's crazy. It's a time and place for everything. Like, you can't wait for the kids to go to sleep, lock the door, get a hotel room. Come on. It's totally irresponsible to you expose your children to that. But if they are not here, there is very little we can do. I know your husband paid tuition in advance for a year. See that unless there is a valid excuse for- She's dead. Yeah. Nah, I mean, not yet that she's dead, but it's like, I can understand why she would, you know, why she, yeah, she feels con- She's in a messed up situation. So how does this croft pass with Leon? Is what I, what I want to know. If that is Leon. Oh yeah, he said it in, in the beginning. I forgot. When things could look black, possibly go wrong. Been a most unusual look at him look at him he's enjoying that <laughs> look at him it's crazy because outside of his work he seems simple and pure i don't know it's like always this hard just when you're a kid always like this he not lying man life does not get any easier unless you work for it you gotta work to make your life easier. Hey, I'm going grocery shopping. Uh oh, some, some they strap. Coming after. The... Oh, it's the same dudes as the last time. He did say noon. What the heck was that? I like the moments before the storm. Oh, hell no. Nah. Something crazy about to happen. <sighs> was that like an adrenaline pill? Or he, this guy's taking his own thing. When you put your head to the grass, you can hear the insects. <laughs> this guy's a weirdo. I'm gonna play this out. <laughs> oh my god. He was a teenager, right? Oh my gosh. Oh jeez. They got scared. They got scared of the um this guy got no. We said noon. That's why I stopped. <laughs> this guy's giving me uh psychotic vibes. OD. Oh man. You're a Mozart fan. Crazy. I love Oh the little boy. It was us here, you know. For this kind of work. What are you doing, huh? Man, keep your bomb buck up. Yeah, knock it off. Oh, he's trying to reach. You check the mattress? Nope. <laughs> yeah, that mattress was a classic spot to store things. I don't know if people still do that. People still store things in their mattress. Oh no, run, run, kid. 
These guys do just don't need to have guns. Wow. No aim, no nothing. Mmm. <laughs> the whole family gone. Except the daughter. The daughter went out for the milks, right? Oh, fuck! Dad, you did it! Dad. Damn, he's walking him down for real. Damn. What, are, what are you doing? He's dead. But he ruined my suit. I know, but he's dead. Bitch, mate, forget about it. Emptied the whole magazine on him. Benny! Great, Benny! It's Mafia Stan! <laughs> Friendly fire, man. Friendly fire. Benny! Revolver. No shell. No shell, no case, right? Benny, don't fire! Get it! Fucking Christ, Benny! He's trying to calm him down because he really got a screws loose. What's happening out there? No, lady, go back inside. Why don't you leave that family alone? Yeah, calm down, buddy. Calm down. Go back inside. No chill, bro. No chill. How do you go? When, when, where's the cops, man? Better if we go inside, all right? All that shooting and nobody called the cops yet in the hallway? Eh. You do that today, shit. It'll Cops will be there within 15 minutes or less. And all the buildings got cameras now. So in New York City, last time I went, it was just surveillance city right there. Did you really uh, have to do that? No. Yeah, keep walking. Keep walking. Don't don't even look back. He's open the door. Mm. Leon, oh, open the door, man. Would you guys open? Please. Open the door, man. It's giving me anxiety, man. Benny, there are three kids here. And Willie, that asshole, shot the little boy. Damn, they have no, no care in the world for these kids, man. So messed up, these guys. Hey, we missed a little girl, man. I'm gonna try to find. Ah, man. <laughs> Recognize me. <laughs> Yo, I found it. I know. It's the cops outside. You stay here. Y'all waited till last minute to leave. What do you want me to tell him? Y'all gonna get busted. What you mean, tell them? You're gonna be arrested, man. Tell them we were doing. Oh, wow. So they, um, the bounty hunter killers is what's going on. Look at them. About your father. Somebody didn't one day or another. It's like, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do with this little girl now? Your mother, she... She's not my mother. Sister. She wanted to lose some weight anyway. Oh. Not even my real sister. Just a half sister, not a good half at that. Man. She couldn't stand them. Why are you crying? Because they killed my sister sit next to me and cuddle. They usually match right now. I have one in my kitchen. You don't have a pig in your kitchen. It's just in there and I didn't see any goddamn pig. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. Hi, piggy. Okay, so she's Matilda. <laughs> How are you today? <laughs> Five days. What's your name? Leon. See, I knew his name was Leon. It's self-explanatory. <coughs> you have anyone to go to, eh? Play sales? <sighs> That's exactly what I've been doing first. Besides calling the cops, I would have been... I'm gonna get some more milk. Like, where's your family? Like, what's going on? Like... Who do I send you to? You ain't staying with me. Shit. Excuse me, miss. Digging in stuff you're not supposed to. What exactly do you do for a living? Cleaner. You mean you're a hitman? Cool. Oh yeah, he cleans all right. You clean anyone? No women, no kids. <laughs> Do you clean anyone? Those dirt bags who killed my brother. Exchange. You teach me how to clean. Is it a deal? No, it's not a deal. <laughs> what do you want me to do? I've got no place to go. Go to sleep and we'll see tomorrow. And in the not always like that. Aww. 
I guess this is a good thing to soften Leon's heart because he must be have a really hard shell. You know, look at him. Look at how he sleeps. You got a whole mattress and you sleep on a sofa, on a chair. He needs to calm down a little bit. He can't sleep. Uh oh, it's time. It's time for action. What are you doing? Leon, what's going on, man? Sleepwalking? That's one healthy looking plant. No brown spots, yellowing, just straight green, fresh looking. Every plant I touch just dies. I don't know what it is. It's our breakfast, you gotta take off. Not my problem. <laughs> Read it. I'm learning, but I had a lot of. He doesn't know how to read. I'm a little behind. What did it say? You want to be a cleaner? Yeah. But not with me. I work alone. Thelma and Louise didn't work, and they were the best. Leon, what you doing, man? Take that away. I've been nothing but nice to you. Right outside the door. Right. If you saved my life, you must have saved good reason. Like you let me die, right? But you did open it. Ah, uh, she gants his head. Don't help no, no. me, I'll die tonight. No, I don't want to die tonight. But leave it. I don't think you could do it. I'm sorry. Yeah, you're too young. What's going on? You're like, like nine years old. Stop that. Throw it out the window right now. I didn't mean it like that. What? How's that? Oh my God, I can't. I can't with her, man. <laughs> man, she probably hit some civilians, man. Gotta be careful. You can't just do that. He's pissed off. Looks like the beginning to a beautiful journey, though. Master and Apprentice. Oh, he still got the plant. Matilda, don't you ever do that again or break your head. <laughs> It'll work like that, professional. And stop saying okay all the time, okay? <laughs> Good. Oh, so what is this? They had to move because of that? Yeah. Okay. Expect to use that in this hotel. I have an audition at Juilliard next month. I'm well, gonna uh, put you at the end of the. Ah, <laughs> she's yo. She's good at this, yo. And, uh, a little too good. It's not. That's not. Uh. Oh, um, Daddy. Not something you want to be good at, you know, since it's lying. But hey. Thanks, Pop. I'll bring these back in a minute. I have a kid. Seven all day long. Can I leave my plant here? My stuff upstairs. Yup, checking everything out, scoping it. I'm putting in the name. Rightfully so. I want you to teach me how to be like you, but I could learn the basic, the theory. I need time to get my head. Salud. <laughs> Him with his milk. You know when you told me to get this baby out for you? I like to stay in shape. Always stay on top. That's why I never leave this place except to go from heat. To <laughs> what the hell? Check it. One thing's got nothing to do with the other. The closer you get to being a okay. Okay. Position. Stop saying that okay all the time. Taking on her first hit. Okay. No. What? She's gonna do it herself? That makes sense. And that makes sense. Have a bright end the floor. Okay. Yeah, it's kind of too early to uh, too young for this. It's the best way to learn. She's too young for this whole movie. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on. I'll be with you in a second, all right? Give me a few minutes. Thank you. Thanks a lot. No women, no kids, right? Right. Jogger in the yellow and orange. Damn, look at her aim. That aim is, she got good aim already. Not too bad. That's a, that's a faster moving target too. Try to feel his next movement. Take a deep breath. Hold it. Yikes. <laughs> oh my God! One shot, not bad, huh? Can't breathe! Get out of here! Real bullets now? Ah, there we go. Okay, so that was just a paintball. I didn't know paintballs go that far. That's crazy. Okay, working now. I see Leon's the guy of routine. No, thanks. 
Green Camilo. Leon has like a Russian accent, if I'm not mistaken. Look at those old school guns. Still got the rat thing in on um, that tail thing in the back. Leon, all we do is work. Makes you think and it helps your memory. Exactly what you Fun, like a virgin. What the heck is this? N nah, hell nah. Virgin. You need to get put clothes on. What's going on here? Yeah. Happy birthday, Mr. President. <laughs> Mustache and sing in the what a beautiful Gene Kelly? Your turn now. Huh? <laughs> okay, Pilgrim. What the hell was that? Clint Eastwood? So this is like charades, but I guess for films, old films. I don't know, I give up. Me too. I give up. I was just about Don't know who that is either. It's amazing. Leon, really brilliant. <laughs> Best friend, no questions. It's like me, you see. Planted in the middle of a park so that it can have roots. Nah, you don't want to do that because then people will mess it up. Step all over it. They gotta be. <laughs> they gotta be alive. It's been a long time, Leo. And uh, you missed some nice jobs too. Been training. Yeah, I haven't seen him work at all ever since he met um Matilda. Pay as good as working, Leo. Tony, I've been working a long time and I haven't done anything with you. I thought maybe someday I could. You met a woman. Leon. Why does he have your money in the first place? That's a nice Figaro link chain, by the way. If you guys didn't notice, I love jewelry. But what the heck is going on? And already you were in deep shit because of all. Maybe I, maybe I could give to someone, you know. It's your money. I mean, I'm just holding it for Ah, I see what's going on here. Banks always get knocked off. You know, no one knocks off. There's always tons of forms to be filled and all that shit. And the right, it's all in his head. Mm. Your money's here. Whenever you want it. Okay, no, no, it. come on. Go come on, on. on, take it. Thank you. All right? This guy's a sleazeball. He's a sleazeball. He's, he's, mm-mm. Glass of milk for my friend Leon here. He's taking advantage of him. Better be careful. Can't just speak to any guy the street. What's a big fucking deal? I was about while I was waiting. Language, little missy. I want you to stop cursing. Can't. Yeah. I want you to make an effort to talk. See, that's what she needs. She needs a nice father figure, nice and to get to have structure and all that. That's what she needs. She needs that. Stay away from him. Looks like a weirdo. I'll be out in five minutes. Stand where I can see you. I think I'm kind of falling in love. Oh. Excuse me? What? How do you know it's love if you've never been in love before? Where? Um, you need to get that out of your head, lady. I mean, little missy. You need to get that out of your head, little girl, because what? This is making me uncomfortable. I always had a knot there, and now... Matilda, I'm glad you... What the heck? I don't think it means anything. Late for work. I had been late for work. Word, what the heck? Oh, is he going to work? It's been a minute. Come on now. Show me some. Now, nah, I ain't gonna lie. This is kind of a disturbing situation. What? You better set it straight, Leon. Oh, that's close to Times Square. Cool. I like how all the cars look all boxy and everything, just like back in the days. I remember when the cars used to look like that. Me being an, I'm a 90s baby, so I guess you call that, people call that a millennial. How are we today, miss? Received any complaints at all? Well. What exactly does your father do? Except he's not really my father. He's my lover. Oh my God. Little girl. Let me find out this is not, this is a horror movie. This is, this is disturbing me. 
What are you doing, sir? What about dinner? Visiting friends at 6J. Oh, okay, <laughs> Office again is Mac on over there. Oh man, that's gotta be disturbing. Traumatic experience. I can't even imagine, bro. Okay, she found a little stash. Those are all ones. They look like ones. Oh shit! We know you're a busy man, and we'll if you'll just take us. Get out of there, Matilda. Get out of there, little girl. What you doing there, just chilling. Bang! We shot him. I would have ran out. Where exactly were the kids? I don't know. But in your statement, you said you were the first man in, didn't you? I lost a good man here. What the fuck do you want? I haven't got time for this Mickey Mouse. What is he? Is he a lawyer? What's going on? Hey, hey come on, that's my fault. He's just working. He's working with the cops. Has to be. <laughs> oh, he is a cop. That explains a lot. Cause that didn't make no sense to me. Follow the blue car. I suppose you want me to blast. Take the hundred bucks and shut the fuck up, okay? You just gave me a great idea. I used to love Transformers, man. Watching as a kid. <laughs> I love anything. How do you like it? I see. Can I have a word with you? Oh, he got in trouble. Damn, they gotta move again. She keep messing up his living situations. He lucky he didn't get arrested. If it was today, cops would have been. Yeah, cops would have been been arresting him. Oh, he got shot. What was going on? Got shot. Okay, so he's still working in the backgrounds. I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at that. Was oh, that an old wound that just kind of picked it or something? Trying to take out the bullet. Ah. Mario, go back to the barber shop. We'll finish later. Why he tensed up all like that, man? You know what you're doing, man. You know, you know what you're doing, man. Nice to have been people now. I told you that. Get the chair. Sit down. Sit. I was uh, thinking. He thought his time was up. <laughs> He's like, yo. Something happens to me someday. You're indestructible. Bullets slide off you. The girl, if anything happens to me, to give her my money. Aw, oh, man. Leon's a real one, man. That's very noble of him. Thank you, Tony. I mean, what else are you going to do with the money? You're gone, you're gone. You leave this earth, all that money, it's gone. Fortunately. Little girl, this is not for you, man. Yo, she's playing with fire. How she even found them? I don't know if I'm missing something here. Special delivery from 4602. Oh, oh, okay. Very clever, very good memory. 4602. <laughs> 4602. Special delivery. Now let me guess. Chinese? Thai? Maybe? See, I knew she was going to get herself into some trouble. Ain't no Italian way. food. Oh, here he comes. He goes. Here he goes with the tweak out. Yo, he a tweak. What's your name, Angel? What the hell? That smile. Crazy ass smile. <coughs> I want you to put the sack on the floor. Did I do now? Killed my brother. I'm sorry. Sorry doesn't cut it, man. Sorry does not cut it. And you want to join him? No. This guy is sick. Talk about crooked cop. You start to become really afraid of death. Appreciate life. Do you like life? Yes. 
If you don't get out my face with that stink ass breath, man. Ew, don't touch me. Don't touch her. I take no pleasure. Smack him. If it's from a person who doesn't care about it. Man, I've been looking all over for you, man. Let's like check upstairs. This guy came from the outside. He fucking came out of nowhere. Boom. Leon. Dead in two seconds. Damn. Then turns around, monkey like. <sighs> oh, Leon coming at the yard. Yeah. This is whimsical. Y'all in trouble now. Why are you pointing it at him like that, man? If I was him, I would have been tight. I would have been mad. Did you take her up to my office? All right, yeah. Oh, Christ. <laughs> I know where to find the guys who killed my brother. I'm going to do them myself. If something goes wrong. Leon, my love? I know I'll feel better after I do this. Oh, I can't park in front like this. <laughs> nine milli and another nine milli. Maybe she was planning on taking out the whole building. Damn, she took Leon's whole uh whole ars arsenal right there. That's not cool. Here, lunch. Might be poison. Oh, man. There's no anchovies on it. Oh, Leon just comes in quick and quiet. Is that what you call? I won't be for at least ten minutes. You can't do that into you, you can't do stuff like that today, man. There'll be a whole army SWAT waiting for you in there. Yeah. Crazy. What's going on? Throwing a party for your ki for your kids, man, with Leon's money? Hmm. I think Leon should get at get at him. Okay. Okay, what's going on now? How they how the hell they found out that he deal with Leon? That's exactly why today. And you know who came and gone right there in <laughs> the very Italian hitman. I'm dying to meet him. <laughs> Relax. Everything's fine. Got one eye open, Louis. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I'm gonna go get some milk for breakfast. I will two knacks, then one and two knacks again, right? Leon, you got some good rest. Okay. That's what I need. I ain't gonna lie. Ain't nothing I appreciate more than a nice, nice bed. Ah. <laughs> Bring these up, I'm gonna go get some milk. Oh, damn. From here on out, you don't make you answer my questions. But oh, he squealed him out. Is he alone? Does he expect you? See, I knew that guy wasn't no good at the restaurant, man. Supposed to bank on um, dude, like, man. Dude is a no bueno. No good, man. Did him dirty, man. Alpha team, final position. We're ready to go. He's probably not even there. Been on the prowl. Let's see. Been on the prowl lately. <laughs> oh shit. Alpha team. I told you. Benny. Everyone! Jeez. Everyone. You bugging. You off that wacky pill again. Okay, that's pretty realistic. I can't stand with movies. Just make it too easy for the uh, main character. I hate that. I like it. The challenge is always necessary. It's more realistic for sure. So I, I appreciate that aspect of the movie for sure. <laughs> Don't move. He's here. He's got a gun in my head. <laughs> now take it easy, man. Let the girl go. Okay, the girl's coming out. <laughs> oh, 
grab the axle. Oh, you're looking down too fat, too much, man. I'm coming with us. I told your man to move. Bastard! Damn, they don't care. Move, 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 move! Shut the fucking water off! That was smart. I repeat, send the cats. That I guess that will block their vision a little bit. I didn't see him coming, I swear. Stay away from the window. Man, Matilda. Nah, I think. Oh. Windows too. They they going after them. Like, I don't know how they're gonna escape this. Little girl is a good ass actor too, man. She is a good ass actor. They got him? Okay, he's right there. Damn. Snipers. Mmm. That's all out of there. Give it to me, we're checking out. Was he trying to escape through there? They bring the they bring the big gun out. Oh my gosh! It's a shame because I don't like, I don't know how Leon gonna escape. Listen to me. Oh my god. Listen to me. We've got a lot of money with Tony. A lot. Just the two of us, okay? Oh man. I don't want to lose you. My goodness. You've given me a taste for life. They're going hard for him, man. Bad have roots. He's got rocket launchers after him and all. I love you, Matilda. Go, go, go. <laughs> what the? He can't even escape through the windows because the snipers too. That shit crazy, man. Said so take the guy out, not the whole fucking building. Get a medic on the horn. We got who to bad here. Right one. <gasps> That's Leon. That smart guy. Yo, he's smart, man. Yo, that's so. This is how he makes his grand escape. Two hundred men, and you can't find one man on a girl. <laughs> Two hundred men. Wow. You're from the third precinct. All right, fine. Oh, I think he noticed. Ain't no way, bro. Damn. What a situation. Let me put the mask back on. I breathe better with it. Come on, everybody out! Come on, what are you doing here? Get out, get out. Come on. Oh, I saw him in the room. No way. No way. Oh man. That was a cool shot too from first person from Leon's perspective. Damn, that's crazy. Shit. Damn. He got him though at least. He got him from Matilda, man. That's a real one right there. So his last breath, man. That's crazy. Wow. Leon asked me to help you out. It's better in the bank, cause you know banks always get knocked off. Oh no, you're not gonna play that again with with um with her now, too. Every once in a while, and I'll dish it out so fun, okay? Can't I get a job? A job? What the hell can you do? I can clean. <laughs> the game's over. Leon's dead. Yeah, he's tight too, man. He's affected. Even though you, you was taking advantage of him, though. So I don't know what is it. What? I think I ain't hurt. Are you feeling bad? Yes. Get your little ass back to school, Gabish. Gabish tells me I'm about to lose my famous kind streak. Mm. 
You know, we didn't have the time to get to know one. I'm going to help you and do my best. I want you to take a chance. Now tell me what happened to you. Long story, miss. He died this morning. If you don't tell, I'll be dead by tonight. Oh, the plan. He deals the cards and he wins the sacred geometry of charm. So, yeah, guys, man, that was a crazy movie. It was a lot of ups and downs for me. Mostly ups, but there was a few downs for me. That relationship with her and him was a little bit off to me. Uh, Leon, you know, Leon didn't proceed to feed into her little weird little thing she had going on with him. But he didn't shut it down completely, which I expected him to do, you know. And uh, but other than that, though, at least he didn't feed into it too much. He didn't. Well, he didn't feed into it. And um, he really was a professional. He did some things that was like while he was doing his little action stunts and little, you know, shooting. He, you know, he was really on that. He was like very acrobatic, surprisingly, you know, from, from his fit. He's kind of like, you know, stiff and all that. But he was surprisingly agile and he would just do like his little Batman things. And that was crazy to me. This movie is very conflicting to me when it comes to uh, what I've seen growing up in New York City. Growing up in New York City, man, I don't live in New York City anymore. But growing up there, I've seen <laughs> I've seen some weird things with neighbors and all what you what not, you know. So it really brought me back to the inner city, you know. Um, yeah, I mean, I was alive. Around the 90s in New York City, running around as a kid, early 2000s. And yeah, to see uh, to see her in the beginning, Matilda in the beginning, had having those bruises and her getting abused, you know, just straight up abused as a child, dysfunctional family, being her being exposed to things that she's not really supposed to be exposed to, her parents being very irresponsible, father- Seems like he was dealing with some type of, you know, drugs and stuff like that and put his whole family at risk, which you see what happened. You see what happened. It's just it's it's crazy. And I've seen a little bit of I ain't going to lie. I've seen a little bit of that growing up in the city. I mean, not as to the point like this, where a whole hundred, two hundred man squad team is after you throwing rocket launchers in your apartment that I haven't seen. <laughs> but I've seen some weird things in New York City. And I don't get me wrong. I love New York City. I love going back in Manhattan. You know, I love the city. There's so many, oh, so many things to do over there. So yeah, um, yeah, that was crazy. That was a crazy movie. And the fact that you know Leon died and gave all his earnings to uh, Matilda, man, that just tells you what kind of guy he was, man. That was um, very noble of him. You know, Matilda is gonna be scarred. She's traumatized. And she's gonna live with this growing up, you know, and go through uh, go through her, go through her challenges in life, and ho you know, hopefully she grows up and becomes. It's a movie, but I'm just saying, you know, for in the movie's case, in her, you know, hopefully she grows up into a fine young lady who, you know, becomes successful and stuff like that because it's not easy out there. And this is a shout out to all the all the kids growing up and the kids that grew up as orphans. I deeply feel feel for you. You know, it's it sucks. It's it's a, it's a it's a messed up situation, and I hope you guys can you know I wish you guys happiness and just let you let you know that you'll get through this. You know, and uh, message to all my New Yorkers, love you guys. Yeah, but this was an awesome movie. This was awesome watch. I can see why this is a classic to a lot of people. Yeah, it's definitely going to be in the books. I would watch this again. That's how good this movie was. This movie was so good, I would watch again. And that's, I'm actually going to watch it with uh, my sister. She missed out on this one. So I'm going to probably watch it with her, see her reaction and all that. But yeah, yeah. Well, guys, thank you for watching Swift Reacts TV. If I didn't get to your uh, movie you recommended yet, don't worry. I will get to it. I plan to hit all the movies that I'm recommended. And I'm continuing, I'm still continuing the DC Universe, um, Cinematic Universe. I'm going to do that. So that'll be probably the next video. DC Animated Movie, we're going to continue that as well. And any other recommendations, just let me know in the comments anything you want to say, mean or, or, or good.
you know, I can take it. I can take the heat. Thank you so much for watching. Appreciate y'all. Have a blessed one.